Hi Virgo, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Virgo. All right. Oh, we didn't do our prayer. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing Virgo with a clear, concise message from you. I know it felt different. I was like, why am I touching for anyway? Six of Cups, this came out in the pre-shuffle. Um, so you could be reminiscing about the past or you could be hooking up with um, childhood friends, going over childhood issues, maybe even traumas or hanging out with siblings. Or you could have your own children and you could just be taking a lot of time, um, energy, uh, act, doing activity with them. Um, just really uh, also just being in a very healthy, fitting state of mind and emotion uh, right now you just feel good okay uh, if you're in a love relationship it could be that somebody's older someone's younger someone could be reminiscing about you or vice versa let's see the ace of pentacles yeah um someone could be uh looking for an opportunity to come back to you or you them or looking for an opportunity to where they can build something with you, something foundational. Um, again, health and fitness. Some of you could be just getting in more into health and fitness um, or some health and fitness regimen or routine or getting in the gym or eating right or strength training or starting a garden or something about plants and gardens and things of that nature and growing something. Um, <clears throat> something that's going to take time. Some of you could be thinking about starting a business. Children's book is coming up here. Um, yeah, Eight of Wands here. It's thinking about doing something, um, maybe even a passion project, something that will take you in a new direction. You being swept off your feet into a new direction here. Um, also, there it could be someone wanting to come back to you from the past, have the opportunity to start something new, have an opportunity to speak with you. You could be speaking with someone um, electronically, what's that text message, emails, DMs, th that, you know, kind of communication. There's an opportunity opportunity for you to clear the air. Also, an opportunity for you to travel. You could be traveling with one of your girlfriends, the King of Pentacles. Um, some of you could be talking to um, maybe a father figure, some man in your life or some man in your uh, some man in your life a father figure someone who wants to deal with you or someone who this could be a boss you could be this could be a manager this man is going to give you a lot of information insight about life and you know monetary things and tangible things and what you can do with your money. going to give you a lot of insight about how to grow something or grow or how to get more knowledge about something here. Um, it could be even about going back to school or furthering education or continuing education or someone's going to help you grow something. You have the five of wands. It's competing goals here. Um, it could be a very competitive uh, space that you're in. It could be at work. You could be in sales. If you're not, there's a lot of um, just arguing without mediation, just, you know, pettiness. It's a lot of friskiness. There is somebody, maybe from your past or someone who you have a child with, you wanted to have sex with them or um, the playful banter, something good. You, you guys are going back and forth, flirting via uh, text message. Someone is trying to get your attention somebody i don't know you're trying to fight for what it is you really want with this particular person um this person may have a lot of different people in their energy and you're trying to continuously fight for what you have with them but something is ending the relationship could have ended maybe you need to set boundaries this person comes and goes as they please. There's no structure. There's no routine. You're going to have to get very firm with this person. You're going to have to be very 
unmovable, you know, very dogmatic, just stuck, um, stubborn in terms of moving and allowing yourself to be moved by this person. Um, it may hurt you in the end, but it looks like you're trying to get what you want. You may have to go in a whole nother, you know, path, journey to actually get um, some stability. You might need to go talk to someone also. Um, there's a lot going on here in terms of trying to move the needle to where you want it to be. There's a need for somebody to grow up because, yeah, there's a need for someone to grow up here. Someone isn't, could be under 35, 35 and under, I don't know. Someone's just not ready, okay? And they come and go as they please. They do what they want. They try to intellectualize their viewpoint about everything. Um, they may even view you as confrontational or vice versa. This person has a destructive influence over you or you them. This is what I have for you, Virgo. I don't know what's going on here. Um, it looks like really good, especially in terms of if there are any aspirations that you want to embark on. But um, in terms of another person, another individual, it looks like you just don't control the outcome here and somebody needs to grow up. So this is what I have for you. If it resonates, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link. Thank you, Virgo. Many blessings to you. Take care.